Good morning, Mitsuka. I want to talk to you today about vulnerability. And I want to talk about it on two levels. First of all, on the big level, um, I really treasure vulnerability. I think vulnerability is one of the most beautiful aspects we have about human life, that we're all vulnerable, that we're all feeble, that our bodies break down and um, become dust, ultimately, because that's what happens. A lot of times vulnerability gets confused with the weakness and you can be vulnerable and still be strong. In fact, strength and vulnerability is something that I'm pretty sure I have. Um, if you take the time to really get to know me but it's so hard to maintain because it means keeping an open heart and walking away rather than putting up a fight, um, but also keeping your head held high. Um, and I'm really, really thankful to be vulnerable in a way that I still need people, but yet I can still be strong and offer me, offer them my strength. But I didn't always think I was vulnerable, particularly when I was your age. Um, not that I thought I was invincible. You really can't be born with the Hubble Bobby and think you're invincible. Um, I thought vulnerability was a bad thing until I got to college. Um, and now the older I get, the more my heart is broken and repaired, the more my body is broken and repaired. The more I push myself, the more I realize how vulnerable I am. And that means walking away from situations where I know I'm going to get hurt. Not out of fear, but out of self-preservation. Because I recognize that my battle divider something other than this. Um, and I think a lot of people, it's that need to fight back all the time because then such a fighter and go get it. And then they get disappointed and frustrated when I don't. If I can avoid a fight, believe it or not, I will. Particularly if it's a personal issue. If it's a justice issue, a fight can't be avoided, but personally, I don't want to fight. And so if you don't listen, I will just walk away. Because I am vulnerable and I have to use a lot of energy just to survive. Um, and so, yeah, walking away with self-preservation isn't always a bad thing. Sometimes it's a necessary thing. And you will learn as you age what the difference is, I hope. It's hard. I know it's hard. But you can do it. Okay. That's all I've got for you today, Mishka. You are loved. You are precious. 
and you contain multitudes. Bye.